inside it. Love cereal. Today we are going to Little India for lunch. Cause it's lunch time. And we have a lunch. Let's go please. <laughs> I'm also excited to prove that I know how to wear my hair down and not in a bun on top of my head. Yay! However, I still have it to use my eyebrows. Stop, they don't know. And I'm still using Nate's deodorant. Stop. And the Asian people love this thing. It is hilarious. There go. Yeah! It moves. <laughs> Good or bad? It's pretty good. It smells good. The fruit was so strong. And flowers? Flowers, yeah. And food? And spices. According to the internet, Osby Restaurant is the place to eat here. This no frills corner eatery is arguably the best place in Little India to sample freshly baked chapati. It says from $1 to $5. So if we don't like it, we're gonna go somewhere else. My kind of place. <laughs> You see the egg chicken? You see the brain? Ah, thank you. Then fry chicken masala and chapati too. That's right? Yeah. Ah, okay, take your seat. Okay. Yeah. You can take lamb. Yeah. You can uh, take lamb. The lamb? Okay, man. Holy moly. This looks good. Thank you. Thank you, man. You see chapati. All right. The one, the lamb, and the chicken for you. Yes. The rice with lamb. Your food fork and the spoon. Thumb pushes it into your mouth. Oh. Ah, like this. What? You can take more too. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, good. Good friend. Eat in the traditional way. Yep. Lots of those. <laughs> Several small bones in that bike. Now what do I do? Wow! That was a great experience. I'm so glad we picked this food. The food was good, but the experience was like 10 times better. The man was so nice, he kept coming in correcting how I was eating my food because I wasn't eating it right. It was a great learning experience. It First was. time eating real Indian food. It was awesome. I love these people. <laughs> We've been walking around Little India for like two hours, and this is the first Indian that I've seen. You can do it, Kara. Just a little bit longer. Invisible dress. 
fry. So happy. What are they have tweezers? Before this year is over. I will learn how to wield one of these swords. Our successful trip to the supermarket. Now I just need tweezers. Little India far exceeded my expectations. It was fantastic. So now we are heading to a place called Marina Bay, which is a fun area on the water and it has this big famous garden it's called Garden Spot Bay. It's like a billion dollars and has like half a million species of flowers and trees and everything. Our battery's dying. Oh no. Two of these glass buildings, one's a cloud forest and the other is a flower garden, but they were like $20 to go in. And it kind of reminded me of the Opryland Hotel, so we're not paying that. I wouldn't mind some noodles. I'm in like a noodle withdrawal right now. I haven't had them in like two days. I'm about to eat one of those. Yep. Not everything we try can be a winner. Tara's pretty disappointed. I'm not excited about this. Why? Because my hands are going to get so gross trying to open this crayfish and I'm going to get like one bite of food. She hates it when she has to work for food. How are you supposed to eat this? None of this is edible. You want to try it? Would you like me to open it for you? No, so you don't like sticky hands either. You really wanted noodles. Not these noodles. Nate was really nice and traded with me, so now he's going to eat the crayfish. Not really excited about this. It really doesn't taste that bad. It's just more the idea of what's happening. I'm out on second this one. Kara, was that your first disappointing meal of the trip? It was. You didn't take it very well. I didn't. I had high expectations. Thanks for being nice. That was pretty disappointing. It wasn't very good. Nate has been looking for an ice cream sandwich for days. Actually, since yesterday because we got here yesterday. It is literally an ice cream sandwich. And it is literally a dollar. Red bean, sweet corn, durian. Durian. Durian? Durian no more. Last one, last one. For what? Do you get uh, bread or these? Up to you. You hungry? You bread. Put bread. Bread. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Lots of interesting things. <laughs> I don't really know how to feel about durian, and then I don't really know how to feel about white bread and ice cream <laughs> together. But I'm gonna finish it. It's pretty good. This is the best view of the entire trip. Check it out. Right now we're waiting on the laser show that's supposed to go on with the fountains in the water. We're not sure if we're in the exact right spot to watch it. So if the next clip looks crooked, <laughs> that's why. Alright, hold. 
Tilt your hand more like this. No, like, uh, like in that direction. There you go, now go up. Up. All right, now flatten it out just a little bit. Uh, it's way too much. Now up. Perfect, don't move. Gum is literally illegal in this country. What are the chances that I get gum on my shoe? That looks so fake. I, it, it looks like I'm sitting in Las Vegas. What's that casino that has the sky? Yeah. It looks like I could like to oh, touch it. This is a real sky. We were just walking across the bridge and then we saw this huge parade festival thing across the road so we ran here and here it is. What's happening? <laughs> was happening, but we caught the last song of the parade. Now it's over. This music was stolen from a speaker at an Indian electronics store. Now my arm's sore from holding the camera up to the speaker. <laughs>